we have another special treat for you. Another one of the elite regulars of Kill Tony. This guy has been smashing on this show for years. He gets a little bit better, a little bit stronger every week. A monster. Ladies and gentlemen, roast genius comedy lord, David Lucas. Yeah. Uh, white women think it's fuck now, man. That shit crazy. Uh, they got ass and titties. I'm glad y'all weren't built like that in the 50s. Or, or that would have been way more Emmett Till's. <laughs> Every nigga would have went to and got hung for whistling at a white woman. Like, <laughs> Look at all that ass on that bitch. God damn. <laughs> I'm tired of white girls being woke, pretending that they're black. Uh, I went to this BLM march and I was the only nigga there. Uh, <laughs> it was a whole bunch of white girls saying, they feel my pain. It's, it's like, bitch, really? Do you know what it feels like to go in the store and have somebody follow you thinking that you're stealing? <laughs> oh, yeah, you do. If that was the case, you wouldn't have called the cops when I followed your ass home. <laughs> All right, thank you, man. That's my time. David Lights Out Lucas. Wow. Yeah. Did it again. Yeah. Absolutely. What's up, Tony? <laughs> Absolutely. Hey, all your facial hair on top of that nigga head. Oh, don't make, how do you make fun of both of us at the same time like that? That is not nice. You need to take that, you need to take that motherfucking Bosni hair yarmulke he got and put it on your chin. Oh my God, you son of a bitch. I don't know if you know this guy, this is Tom Papa and this is Tom Popeyes. <laughs> you son of a bitch. This is a chicken heavy episode. Speaking of chicken heavy, David Lucas is here. <laughs> of course I know Tom Papa. He take the yeast out of your pussy and make bread. <laughs> you haven't lived until you've tried our pussy loaf. <laughs> <laughs> that one hurt because it was the first one I understood what he was saying. <laughs> Man, if you don't shut your Quentin Tarantino head ass up, <laughs> that nigga got nigga in his head 75 times right now. <laughs> David <laughs> Lucas coming in, rocking the camo. <laughs> you look like the woods right now. <laughs> I saw Danny Guerrero try to find his lawnmower back there a second ago when he saw you. Tony, you look like a gay ninja. Shut the fuck up, boy. You will catch a ninja star with your booty cheeks, nigga. <laughs> 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 That motherfucker ass like a pin cushion, nigga. You just. <laughs> 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 what else, man? This nigga with a football helmet on want to say something. Oh, you <laughs> stop it. Tom. He does this to everybody, Tom. I'm sorry. Look at that motherfucker. That motherfucker look like Rain Man. No, Boy, you, you stop it, David. You stop it. You're not allowed to make fun of the guests unless they make fun of you. That motherfucker draw you a map he ain't never seen before. <laughs> what is that even? What is that even? <laughs> I don't even know what that means, but it's hilarious. Don't either. <laughs> Look at it, boy, looking like he on trial for touching kids. Oh, come on. <laughs> you stop it. You stop it. I know that nigga was on the Jeffrey Epstein flight. Okay, <laughs> all right. You stop. Right now. Is she 16 or 15? Okay, David. <laughs> David, this is our guest. You can't do this to our guest. That like, motherfucker got a Martha Stewart sweater on. Oh, boy, what? my God. <laughs> that motherfucker got his arms divorced like he going through a divorce hearing. You stop it. I'm never going to be able to book Seinfeld if you keep doing you this. You can't even say that, boy. He looks like he just seen a nigga sneak in his house. <laughs> Still don't understand a word he's saying. <laughs> Well, maybe you should put them thick-ass glasses on your ears. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you better stop it. Hey, put them glasses to the light. Let me see you burn a hole through that table. Oh, my God. 
<laughs> this is a battle of thick glasses uh, and thick asses live dude. on Hill Tony. <laughs> this is absolutely incredible. That's, David that's, Lucas. That's the sweater you get when you bake 100 loaves of bread. <laughs> okay. <laughs> David. That motherfucker got an oven that's milk built in. <laughs> This is what happens that's with... The, <laughs> that's the stomach you get when you eat 100 loaves of bread. <laughs> you had that if shit you don't get your, If you don't get your Quasimodo looking ass... All right, right here, David. Look at this motherfucker, boy. You look like you collect vintage David. Beatles, nigga. Your ass. <laughs> Jesus, fuck, will you stop? What is wrong with you? He got a garage. I swear to God, <laughs> David, what the fuck is wrong with you? I feel, like I'm at, I feel like I'm at the zoo being attacked by a giant sea lion. <laughs> <laughs> Just, you look like you'll get put out of the zoo get, for fondling kangaroos, nigga. <laughs> He's a is this a male or a female? Hold up, I'll tell you. He's a sea lion, all right. You can you can see him lying every time he's at a doctor's appointment. <laughs> no, yeah, I don't eat before bed anymore. Uh, yeah. We know you lie because you check mail on the application, nigga, when you go to the doctor. <laughs> you Sir, are, you have a pussy. How are you a man? You are on fire. What do you think is going on with you? Do you, you eat a specific... What happened before? What did you do before this? You come in guns a blazing. Uh, I ain't gonna tell you because all you gonna do is make a joke. Well, I, you're goddamn right. <laughs> uh, I went to the gym before Kill Tony. <laughs> <laughs> I got By the looks of things, I'm guessing it was Blink Gym. <laughs> <laughs> you and Red Band over here. We got Red Band. We got Black Band. <laughs> We and gay all. man. <laughs> Get your ass out of here, boy. Oh, he's so funny roasting, I forgot all about his set. <laughs> yeah, it was amazing. Are you talking you about You bake kids? bread, nigga. You can't say shit. No, that is not Don't true. make me a cinnamon roll, motherfucker. <laughs> oh, my God, David. You are out of control. I've never seen him like this before. I swear to God, Tom brought me a loaf of bread, and I saw David. And then you sat on it. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta put some peanut butter on this. <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> All right. I'm fucking around, man. I'm fucking around. David, unbelievable. I'm convinced that him giving me a loaf of bread and you getting none made you <laughs> mad tonight. <laughs> that is the only thing that I can put this to. <laughs> what the fuck are you? How to bake bread? What are you Googling yeah, right I'm a, now? I'm gonna bake some bread tonight. Uh, <laughs> Oh, oh my Who's goodness. That? All right. David, yeah. another unbelievable performance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, just an absolute fucking wrecking ball. Yeah. What's going on? Anything you want to plug or anything? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, February 24th and 25th, I'm in Detroit at the House of Comedy. Pull up on me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Detroit, Michigan. Yeah, thank you. There he goes, David Lucas, everybody. Unbelievable. <laughs> Comes in fucking. <laughs> That was great. One more time for David Lucas, everybody. He was amped. 